Let's talk some of our morning movers, some of the companies that we have in focus and stocks that we're looking at for that. We'll start out with welcoming in senior markets correspondent Renita Young, once again with an eye on Tesla. And more bad news there. What's the latest? Well, the latest, uh, shares are down. They're still around that new 52-week low that the company etched in yesterday. But the company is recalling more than 3,800 cyber trucks. The National Highway Traffic Safety Administration said that Tesla needs to fix an issue with the accelerator pedal pad and that the accelerator pedal pad might actually dislodge and get trapped. And this is solely on the cyber truck. And that'll cause the vehicle to actually accelerate unintentionally and increase the risk of a crash. Now, this is coming after the Wall Street Journal report saying that buyers said Tesla pushed back scheduled delivery dates for some cyber trucks without giving any reason at all. And Tesla said that they're going to replace or repair the accelerator pedal assembly free of charge. And by the way, Elon Musk did reference this in a tweet on Twitter earlier this week. He said that there were no injuries or accidents because of this, but that the company is being very cautious about this, Diane. And honestly, because of what's happening with Tesla, it is bad timing. Now, we know that the Cybertruck is not likely to bring in a significant cash flow before the end of the year. We know the company is suffering from weakening demand and also Tesla released a proxy filing that hopes to revive Elon Musk's huge pay package during the same time that the company says it's going to cut employees by 10 percent and this is a it's just a tough time for Tesla shares down around 40 percent year to date maybe a little bit more by now maybe a little bit less as I see that Tesla's turned into the green at the moment but I don't know. Maybe the Bulls are going to eke it out and, and they're going to maybe win today. Looking at the direction of Tesla right now, who knows? Uh, we'll certainly see. I mean, Tesla's had a really difficult year. Uh, you know, yeah, it's up a little bit uh, on the day, but down 39% for the year. Uh, we'll see what happens in terms of if it could potentially post a small win today. Renita Young, thank you for the analysis on Tesla.